hiyo ya kwanza ya pili ni silage ni mkia wa perfume leo let's have a discussion about perfume and body spray and perfumes tulisema kwamba jina sahihi sio perfume ni fragrance na zina categories tano ambazo tushaongelea hapo before na leo hatuingii kuzichambua hizo categories lakini leo tunataka tufanye discussion wanafuse sasa nitafungua hii discussion kwa kutaja perfume 20 ambazo ndio top selling ambazo zinauzwa zaidi alafu tu discuss perfume kwa ujumla mnapenda perfume gani nitakuoneshana perfume ambazo mimi nazipenda tutazipitia hapo mbeleni lakini in the meantime tutagusia tu kwa, kwa ufupi ni vitu gani vya kuzingatia unapochagua perfume cha kwanza perfume ni kama chakula kuna ambao wanapenda kuku kuna ambao wanapenda mbuzi kuna ambao wanapenda kondoo kuna ambao wanapenda bata so it's personal preference kila mtu ana mapendeleo yake na hata wanaopenda kuku kuna ambao anapenda wa kuchoma kuna mwingine anapenda makange kuna mwingine anapenda wa kukaanga so ni vitu ambavyo ni personal kwa hiyo chagua kitu ambacho we binafsi unakipenda na kinakupa furaha that's number one. if you are not sure au ni mgeni kwenye perfume sio lazima mtu unajua kila kitu hata sisi kuna kipindi tulikuwa tuwezi kutembea tukajifunza kutembea tulikuwa tuwezi kuendesha baisikeli tukajifunza kuendesha baisikeli so hata hivi vitu kuna watu ambao ni wazoefu wa perfume lakini kuna wengine ambao ndo wameanza kuingia kwenye anga za perfume so just in case wewe sio mzoefu wala ujui uanzie wapi moja ya vitu ambavyo unaweza kufanya kama ni mtu unafanya kazi ofisini unaweza kuona mtu ukawa nasikia ana perfume nzuri sio mbaya ya ukimuuliza ni perfume gani ukaanzia with the classics perfume ambazo ni classics which you can never go wrong ambao huwezi ukakosea sasa hapa tunaingia kwenye kitu kingine ambacho iko very technical ambacho kina sehemu mbili cha kwanza is longevity cha pili is silage Najua hizi technical terms wengine tunaweza tukawa hatujaelewana lakini naomba ni kuchambulie. Longevity kwa maana kwamba perfume unapoipuliza inakaa muda gani mpaka inapofifia. Na tunaposema inakaa muda gani mpaka tunapofifia siongelei wewe uliyepuliza. Mara nyingi mtu uliyepuliza within 5 minutes pua zako zinakuwa zisha adapt ile harufu kiasi kwamba huisikii tena mara nyingi tunaisikia pale pale lakini tunaongelea we ukishapuliza wengine wanaendelea kusikia kwa muda gani hiyo ya kwanza ya pili ni silage ni mkia wa perfume na maanisha nini nikisema mkia wa perfume kuna perfume zenye silage aina mbili kuna perfume ambayo mtu akipuliza akikatiza hapa unajua hapa tukao kuna mwamba kapita inaacha mkia inaacha trace inaacha footprint ya perfume lakini kuna perfume ambazo hazina silage kwa maana kwamba ukipuliza mtu ukipita haezi kuisikia mpaka ukikaa naye one on one face to face au ukimhug ndo unaisikia so utaangalia unataka perfume yenye kudumu muda mrefu au yenye kudumu muda mfupi and of course zina effect kutokana na bei lakini unataka perfume ambayo ukikatiza watu wajue umekatiza au unataka perfume ambayo mtu wa karibu tu ndo anaweza kukusikia and last but not least ya mwisho kabisa ni jinsi gani unajisikia ile perfume ukiipuliza tukiingia technically kuna scents au kuna notes kuna perfume ambazo zimetengenezwa zina harufu kama ya flower kuna zingine ambazo zina harufu kama ocean baharini kuna ambazo ziko tropical zaidi kuna ambazo zimetengenezwa zina base ya vitu kama udi umeona sasa hivi ni vitu ambavyo viko very technical kwa mtumiaji wa kawaida Hai make sense kuingia. Cha msingi, angalia umeipenda ile harufu, imekufurahisha, well and good. Does it make you feel good? Inakufanya you happy ukiipulizia. That's the most important thing. Siku za mbeleni ukiamua kuingia deeper uweze kujua kwa sababu hizi perfume nazo kuna upulizaji wake kuna za kupiga wakati wa daytime kuna za kupiga wakati wa mtoko kuna za kupiga let's say sehemu za baridi kuna za sehemu za joto kuna za kuendea vacation these are more technical terms lakini at the end of the day kama uzifahamu sio lazima uzifahamu unaweza kaenda kwa mtaalamu anayeuza perfume akakuelimisha So hizi ni list ya perfume 20 ambazo zinaongoza kwa mauzo duniani. Blue Atlas Atlantis 
kuna salvage by dio kuna ds endugas italian citrus kuna tere di hermes kuna tom ford wood wood hii ni mo, tom ford ni moja brand ambao bongo bongo tunaifahamu zaidi kuna byredos mr marvelous kuna blue de chanel kuna frederick mel mask ravager kuna isop hii naomba tusaidiane kuitamka high whale oh i don't know how sijui unaitamkaje naomba wana few tusaidiane kuitamka hii alafu kuna kilian sacred wood kuna the noon core forest lungs hii ni moja na sihitaji kwa sababu inajulikana sana anyway pako raban 1 million kuna Barberry Hero. Kuna Gentleman by Givenchy. Kuna Jean Paul Gaultier Limel. Ndio hii hapa one of my perfumes ambayo naitumia hii hapa. Bonge moja perfume. At least kwangu mimi naipenda. Japo pia iko kwenye list ya top 20 most selling perfumes in the world. Kuna Club de Nuit Intense. Kuna Dolce and Gabbana the one kuna Maison Margiela replica by the fireplace Bonge moja perfume hii hapa Victor and Rolf Spice Bombs Extreme Kuna 8 and Bob This is my favorite perfume Mont Blanc Legend Bonge moja perfume Kuna Creed Aventas hiyo wengi tunaifahamu Li Labo Santa 33 Maison Francis Crudigian Aqua Vitae. Ise Miyaki ni brand ambayo inajulikana kibongo Nuit de Say. Hizo ndo top 20 most selling perfume. Ndo perfume 20 ambazo zinaongoza kwa mauzo duniani. Nimezitaja bila kufuatilia yani mpangilio sisemi ipi ni bora zaidi ipi sio bora zaidi. And at the end of the day tumesema kwamba mtu unaangalia binafsi ipi na kufurahisha. So mimi binafsi huwa na hizi mbili ambazo nazipuliziaga zote kwa pamoja hizi ndo base perfume zangu then ina depend naenda wapi au ni kwa ajili ya shughuli gani then nita mix naweza nika mix hizi na kwapa lazima nazipulizia kwa pamoja naweza nika mix na hii au naweza nika mix na hii it depends naweza nika mix na Azaro it depends and moja ambayo haipo ni Mont Blanc Legend that's my favorite yani and my body spray ni hapa X Excite so One of you let's discuss what's your favorite perfume unapenda perfume aina gani je una mix perfume au unatumia perfume moja kwa sababu tumetofautiana elimu za perfume kuna chochote ungependa kushare na sisi ila ukitaka kufahamu zaidi aina za fragrance tuliongelea before hapo nyuma perfume kuna EAUD perfume kuna EAUD toilet EAUD cologne EAUD fresher hizo ni aina kuu tano za perfume so unatakiwa ujue ipi ni ipi na ubora wake ukoje so just in case unataka kuzifahamu unaweza ukarudi nyuma in the meantime tukutane kwenye comment section leo let's have a discussion about perfume and body spray and kwa ujumla cologne it's your take DJ Smart 255 hapa hapa S and S